oh hi, you just caught me in the middle of having a drink before I'm sent off to the fucking concentration camps. Just give me a second. Yep, that'll do it. Now, give me a second. I'm actually going to say this first. So, everyone knew that it was either going to be soft or hard fascism. Basically, tonight, the U.S. has chosen hard fascism. Neo-Nazism, basically. America has fallen to fascism, one way or the other, and it was going to be said one way or the other. America has fallen to essentially what would become a neo-Nazi police state under Fuhrer Trump. Now, I, of course, will not accept this man as my president, nor would I have ever accepted him as my president. Frankly, I would support Kim Jong-un over Donald Trump. And ultimately, when it comes down to it, with it looking very close, I just cannot, basically, I'm just, I cannot, in good conscience, support Donald Trump as my president. Anything he wants me or my country to do, I will not do it. I will refuse. And I will refuse it on ideological and moral grounds, something that his supporters cannot fucking comprehend. And if that means me being arrested and sent off to some FEMA concentration camp under his presidency, well then so fucking be it. I have said it before and I will say it again. I will die a martyr if I have to for revolution. I will die, you know, I would much rather die for the cause of Californian independence or for communism, you know, you pick which one I'd rather do. I will die either way. This is just one of the things that had to be said. Now, obviously, um, tomorrow, uh, on November 9th, uh, most likely this being on the day that I release this, by the time I actually release this, it will already have happened, but there will be a, um, there will essentially be a rally for independence at the state capitol in California, which will basically be our way of, basically our way of essentially stating that we will not support, that, that we are basically forced to support this, but we will not support this, that we are declaring our independence, that we will not stand for fear of Trump standing over, presiding over this, na over our nation, over our Californian nation. With that said, I don't really think that there's anything more I have left to basically talk about. America, you've sealed your fate. Now we get to watch you burn. I'm NorCal Nick, leader of the revolutionist movement, and this has been NorCal Corner.